How are we all doing out there? I hope you're all spot on and uh, thanks for watching the video. Now I've been shopping to Iceland. Come and have a look what I got. I haven't been in Iceland ooh, for about a month. And I was having a little walk around and I seen these and I noticed they were new. Grill house. Five charcoal grilled tandoori chicken sheesh kebabs with a two chilli rating. Air fry in eight minutes. 250 grams and there is the lovely serving suggestion. I think I'd have had a, a few more of them sheesh kebabs on there rather than just one. Anyway, the price. Yes, the price. They were four pounds. So, yeah, I'd say that's pretty expensive. So let's take a look at the packaging. So the only reason I say it's expensive, putting it into context, is that you can get two chicken breasts, room to roam, 300 grams for £3.75. Um, yeah, and I know that these have got, you know, done tandoori, you know, spices. But let's just put it into context. Anyway, we've had a look at the front. Let's, um, let's just get into them. There they are. I will count them. We have got five. My maths are correct. So let's have a look at here. Uh, some spiel. It's got origin of chicken, Ukraine. So we've got some Ukrainian chicken. However, we do have a GB sticker there. 250 grams, like I say. Grill house. Five charcoal grilled Tandoori chicken shish kebabs. So we've got charcoal cooked minced chicken leg meat. So we've got chicken leg, not breast, with garlic, ginger and tandoori style seasoning. That's how they're done. Origin of chicken Ukraine, like I said. Nutritional information there if you want to have a look at that in more detail. Go ahead. So we've got a warning, although every effort has been made to remove all bones, some may remain. This product may have adverse effect on activity and attention in children. Wowzers. That is a warning I've never seen before. Yeah, why, why is that then? Let's have a look at the ingredients. There they are. Allergen is celery. So why has it got an adverse effect on activity and attention in children? That is a strange, bizarre warning. If ever I've seen one, never seen one like that before. Yeah, is it because of all them spices? I don't know. I don't know. If you know in the comments, please um, let me know. Preparation instructions for best results cook from frozen, which these are. You do them in the air fry, oven, pan fry or microwave from frozen. It's up to you. I'm going to air fry mine. Best before 25th. Of the 5th, 25. Frozen on 26th of the 5th, 24. Yeah, so that's a bit of a strange one, isn't it? Very, very strange warning. So we've had a look at the... Um, we've had a look at them. There they are in there, frozen. Let's get them open and see what we have got. Yeah, I will have a look at them um, ingredients in a little bit more detail when they're cooking. But let's um, let's get them open. Let's do the seal peel test. Yeah. Oh no. That was that. Oh no. I think that was my fault. You've got to get them open. You've got to get them out of all packaging. So, um, we've got a bit of frozen ice on the bottom there. Yeah. That's how they are. Look. That's what you get. Frozen block of chicken, chicken leg, and garlic. Right, let's get them in the air fryer. And uh, please remember, if I could ask you kindly, to um, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you like the videos. That does help the channel, so thank you very much for that. So I'm just um, warming a flatbread up, or tortilla. Do it in the pan, and I'm going to do it with some garlic, and mayonnaise, and some chilli sauce. So all I've done is just crushed one clove of garlic up and um, put some mayonnaise in there and there you go, it's a simple uh, garlic mayonnaise. So that's nice and warm, just got to watch it on the old pan because if it goes too, do it too much it goes hard. So I've caught it just at the right time, so I'm getting me garlic mayonnaise on there and I'm just going to spread it on, spread it all over. Like that. 
Mm. Oh, that's smelling good. Oh, I love garlic. Keep the old uh, vampires away, that's for sure. <laughs> Keep some away. Liking that. Right, let's get some chilli sauce on the old situation. So I'm just going to go just like that with chilli sauce. Dead easy. That'll be enough. Just spread that in as well. Um, I mean, you can put what you like on it, yeah? But I'm going with the old garlic and chilli sauce. Oh, that's smelling good now. Look, loads of vegetables on there, isn't there? Look at all these. I dare say that's probably tzatziki. Who knows? And that's a different, obviously, a proper flatbread, isn't it? But just make, I'm just using what I've got in my cupboards. They're done. There they are. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to get them on here. Because I'm going to eat this, obviously. I'm not going to review this. I'm going to put four on, because I'll be eating that. And um, then I'm going to review this one. So there's me one I'm eating. <laughs> that's how it's going down the hatch. But beforehand, I'm going to open one of these up. I'm going to have a look at it. It's, it's feeling a bit... It's, it's feeling a bit... The outside texture is very strange. There's the inside. Yeah, it's... Um, obviously all the spices in there, right? Um, let's, let's, let's try it. Yeah, it's smelling okay. Smelling okay. So there we are. Let's try this. It's just a strange texture. And I'm not keen on the spices, I'm not keen on the flavour. The texture is off putting. It's like hard on the outside, and then it's sort of like a rubbery chicken on the inside. And I'm not too keen on the I'm not too keen on them them spices. But that's just my personal opinion. My old uh, selfie stick's dropping again. Very sorry. Yeah, it's um, it's well seasoned as well. It's, 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 it's just a minute. I'll just have a look at the ingredients again. As if by magic, I'm holding this now. The powers of editing, eh? Yeah, it's um, it's charcoal cut minced minced. Well, it is minced chicken leg meat with garlic. Ginger and tandoori style. Not getting any ginger or garlic coming through. Really, it's just it's a. I mean, there's loads of spices in there. And let's try that. Mm. Put too much in again. I dare say it's, it's better with obviously accompaniments, but it shouldn't be, should it? You should be able to taste it and you should go, oh, that's lovely. You might like it. We're all different. I'm just one person trying it. One person. We're all different. Well, I'm not that keen. I'm not that keen on the texture. I'm not that keen on the flavour. However, I am going to eat it. I hate wasting food. I've slathered it with a load of chilli sauce and garlic mayonnaise. Help it go down. And at £4, the price point, please let me know what you think. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks for watching and subscribing. I do appreciate it. I'd be interested in your thoughts. So I won't be buying it again. That's for sure. But I'm glad I tried it. That's what it's all about. Variety is a spice of life. We've got to try new things. If we don't try, we won't know, will we? And I love, I always like doing different stuff. 
Anyway, I'm going off on one here. Start, it's going to start to tell a little story in a minute. It's dropping. It's going down again. I'm going to have to get myself a new selfie stick. So take care of the best and I'll get back to the next one.